Hey everybody, it's three guys with three things, and we'll start with two men who are the go-to guys for the artificial intelligence mainframe, Mike Spofford and Weston Hoskowitz. I think that's Hotkowitz. Either one Mike, works. you're up. Well, that's quite the introduction. I'm going to start by saying the San Francisco 49ers are a darn good football team. I don't think that's a news flash really? to anybody in here. They won 12 games this season, might have been 13 if they hadn't rested their guys in the final regular season game. They outscored their opponents by almost 200 total points over the course of the season. But here's one thing about that statistic. Only one of those victories by the 49ers was a one-score game. These guys have not been in a lot of close games. And the pressure, much like it was last week when it was all on Dallas, is kind of all on San Francisco. So with the pressure on that side and the fact that they haven't played really a lot of tight games, get them in a close one. See what happens. All right, Weston. Larry, this is my 12th year covering the Green Bay Packers, and I don't know if there's been a guy that I've enjoyed more being a part of his media scrums than John Runyon. I love the perspective he brings. He has a big-picture mindset, and I enjoyed what he talked about on Wednesday. He mentioned this. This is a young football team, unequivocally. Very inexperienced in a lot of different ways, but the one thing they've gained throughout the course of the season is perspective. Perspective on where they were at the mid part of the season, perspective on where they are right now, and where this team still wants to get to. And it's all right there in front of them. That's one of the things I don't think it's talked about enough with this football team. Yeah, they're young, but they've gained a lot of experience now too. Guys, keys to the game. One of them can be summed up in three words. Pressure on Purdy. And for those keeping score at home, over the last three games, the Packers have 13 sacks and according to Pro Football Focus, 77 pressures. Just saying. And that's three guys with three things. See you next time.